Hey, what's up guys? Uh, David here. I know a couple of you had asked about how uh, I was gonna use my A-frame to lower the mast, so I was gonna show you how I did it. Already did this this, this morning, the mast is already down, um, but I can show you how it works here. So I found this technique actually on my Catalina 22 forum. This is the A-frame I built uh, right here. So I've got a line attached to the top of the A-frame that runs to the stem fitting, which is disconnected from the furler, uh, which is just laying loose here on the deck. Um, see right here, coming back up. Um, the A-frame, you can see I've got a uh, snatch block there, which run back uh, to the mast that's tied around with the bowline. On the back side of that bowl, and you can see I've got my halyard, which runs up as, is, uh, you know, attached to uh, over there. So it's locked up against the shredders that, that provides a stable contact point there. Once that's connected um, and your A-frame's connected, you can raise it up. You want the A-frame to be sitting in a less than perpendicular position, maybe, you know, 15 to 20 degrees off. Um, and then you, that line you ran to the mast, you run down through your jib car that's all the way forward to a winch, and you just ease everything down once you've lowered all the shrouds. So that's pretty much the gist of how I did it. I used it today to uh, pull the mast down. I retrieved my jib halyard, and I was able to replace uh, both sheaves on top of the mast here. They were already cracked up and uh, needed to be swapped out anyway. So. Uh, wrapped up with this project we'll see how easy it is getting back up uh, we lost one of our guys so it'll be me and one other guy we'll see how well how easy this is for two people so uh, I'll let y'all know thanks